connection. 6, 15, 11. I know now how Sleeping Beauty felt in that coffin of glass. I know why she ate that apple. I figured out that she didn't give a shit if that prince ever kissed her because he didn't get her anyway. After a few years of marriage, he called her a bitch. She knew it was coming. He swept her off that pedestal and she let him see her real eyes, real hair, real heart. He was sure he was cheated. Contract unwritten, unfulfilled. One beauty, always to act predictably and be ready to fulfill his every need at a moment's notice. She was an aberration and fiercely glad, but she loved his silly ass. He was jealous of what she did well, jealous of her woman's heart, jealous of those damn dwarfs. Wanting only a wife, a son, a life in his own image. His own thoughts creating the only connection he could know, never hers. She could get into his, but never could he get into hers. She could know his failings, but he could never know. Her failings were not what he thought, but that she loved.